focus at King Charles Carousus at this tavern. Strange to drink and make merry on the eve of war. Today marks the end of an age. All drink, dance, and sing to the madness of the king. I will drink to that. Life is too short for abstinence. Ah, but wine is a mocker. Drink is the devil's sacrament, and like its master, it only deceives. The fat king. What other king could I mean? They say he sleeps here. He slept here, he ate here, he drank here, and he left here. Where he went after that? Who am I to say? No luck finding the king. Eivor! No, no luck. Finding such a large, famous man should be easy, but not for me. Come, let us drink. Who are these strange folk? Fools with no shame and no honor. Players who perform for the king. One of these fools may lead us to that greater fool, the king. <laughs> Don't bother. It's like talking to drunks or goats. Or drunken goats. Eivor, I, I should thank you. Uh, for what? For backing me against Siegfried. He will not talk to the Franks, but we should still try, yes? Yes. And you can do this thing, with or without him. But I failed. Nobody here will tell me where to find the king. What should I do? A wise shield warrior must know both swords and words. Watch and learn. <laughs> Greetings, good sir. I would offer my sword to your king. Where may I find him? When the great bear was sleeping, the jesters went creeping into the great bear's room. The jesters were all drinking, dancing and singing, even if waking the bear spells doom. The bear might be the king, so the king had a room. Pantomime is a naughty boy and a naughty pantomime be he. He drank down wine, he crept upstairs, and he stole the fat bear's key. Oh. Watch and learn, you said. See? Not so easy to find the king, is it? Acting strange. Where is your king? As mute as the dead. No matter. The other side must be barred. Charles, 
Found what I need. Charles enjoys the theater in Amiens. Good. Let us go. No, he may lash out if he meets one of Siegfried's clan. Best I go alone. As you wish. But meet me here when you are done and tell me what he said.
By the length of his sock. Ay, ay, ay. Do not measure our royal majesty by the size of his anything. Instead, gauge his world. Desperately be honest. Or a cook. Grand pantomime, again you air. The worlds are like bodies. It's yet ever float up you. Ruler's legal deeds rather than his talk. Good, Alucard. You have made everything suddenly and abundantly clear. Looks like the backstage. Maybe chance likes with it. Oh, daughter of Babylon, who art to be destroyed. Happy shall he be that takes the little ones. Yes, Stephen. What? What does it do to the little ones? He dashes them against the stones. No. No, 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 no. <sighs> it is only the heathen, led astray by Lucifer, but mortal all the same. Charles, I heard two voices. Who else is back here? No one but me and this weak creature of flesh. <coughs> uh, forgive me. Talking to that which does not exist opens the door for something that does. This I know. <laughs> Let me assure you. My demon exists. As does my god. <coughs> Kill me. Make me a martyr king. I should slay you where you stand for that trick you played on me and the queen. <laughs> that will not get you what you want, huh? Peace and uh, a free hand in England, correct? Odo won't see reason. Siegfried wishes to burn the city down, but you... You can save Paris. If the world was so simple, bread would grow on trees. Odo is a great man, with greater ambitions. All of my nobles make demands of me. So does the Pope, and the Greeks, the Slavs, the Saxons, the Saracens. And you, huh? <laughs> you Northmen. You demand land. Hostages tribute. Sometimes the best move is not to move at all. You would let your enemies slaughter one another. I will let my enemies paint God's green earth red with infidel blood. While pious Charles prays only for peace. Is there nothing you want? Yes. By now you know I... You are not a wit for my barren wasteland of a wife. But your son, Bernard. My only heir. Bring me the prince, unharmed, and I will consider the merits of your offer. Else be gone. You want him brought to a dingy theater where you talk to yourself in the dark? Hmm. No. Present my son to me on the field of battle, before all my men and vassals. Why then? Why wait? My nobles need to see me getting something from you, northerners. Now, until that day dawns, there is the door. In the back of a darkened theater!
Vento al marito. You look none the worst for ale. How much did you drink? Not enough to make me enjoy those awful Frankish skulls. But tell me, will Charles sign a truce? He will not even speak to us until we hand over his son, Bernard. But we do not have the bastard boy. No, but I know where the Queen took him. The Plague Ward, south of the city. I will gather my thanes and take them hostage. To seize the Prince lacks honor. We should keep an eye on the boy all the same. Hmm. I know a man of keen eye and light step. Pierre. A wise choice. So, one step closer to breaching the walls and burning a city. Yes, and I do not want this thing. What else can we do? See you back at the camp, Toka.